Do you enjoy the ocean and are intrigued about the lives of millions of its aquatic animals? Well, there are many creatures in there that are capable to kill you in a matter of minutes and you should know about them. The blue-ringed octopus is one such animal. The whole persona who screams a warning, don't you dare mess with me, I'll kill you, is today's protagonist of the video. They are golf ball sized octopuses that bear a toxin that can kill tens of people within minutes. They have bright blue rings all over their body, which glow when they are about to attack. Blue ringed octopuses, comprising the genus Hapiloclina, are four highly venomous species of octopus that are found in tide pools and coral reefs in the Pacific and Indian Oceans, from Japan to Australia, where people have died of their bites. The blue ringed octopus is one of the ocean's most interesting creatures. See those beautiful blue circles? Those aren't to make it look pretty. That's warning coloration. At first glance, this tiny octopus looks perfectly innocuous. Its psychedelic coloring and pint sized packaging make it seem more adorable than alarming. Don't let its endearing exterior fool you. The bite of a blue ringed octopus is one of the deadliest the world has to offer and it comes in an ounce-sized, squishy package. The species tend to have a lifespan of approximately two to three years. This may vary depending on factors such as nutrition, temperature, and the intensity of light within its habitat. The animals terrorized by it are crustaceans, crabs, and shrimps, among others. They don't leave any chance to bully any injured fish if they catch one. It jumps onto its prey, grabbing it with its tentacles and pulling it towards its mouth. The prey is paralyzed, then eaten. For animals with tough coating, the horny beak comes in handy. As the beaks of these octopi are so strong, they can penetrate through a wetsuit. They are also known to fight with other octopuses in the area to be able to keep their food and shelter to themselves. Despite their size of just 12 to 20 centimeters and relatively controlled nature, they are very fatal to humans if provoked. All credit goes to its venom, which contains an extremely potent marine neurotoxin, tetrodotoxin which is found in nearly every organ and gland of its body. Starting at around the size of a pea and growing to a size of a golf ball, this little guy can often be missed at sight. This killer beauty prefers to keep away from any kind of trouble and spends most of its time hiding in crevices while posing effective camouflage patterns on its skin. Not just that, it piles up rocks outside the entrance of its lair, adding to safety against predators. Now, enough with its shy, protective introvert side. It's time to know what happens when provoked. The moment the blue ringed octopi is provoked, his skin changes color to bright yellow along with 50 to 60 flashing bright rings. It all happens in one third of a second, clearly as a warning to back off, giving us the last notice. Look at that, wow. Along with the blue rings, there are dark rings and sometimes multiple layers of rings. Finally, it loses its cool and releases its venom in a bite, giving its opponent a merciless death. At first, the victim doesn't realize it as they inject their venom by a relatively painless bite that produces two small puncture wounds until respiratory depression and paralysis begin. The blue ringed octopus is said to hold two classes of venom in its saliva the ability to kill its prey with one type of toxin whilst the other is used for defense. Beware of its bite, as a blue ringed octopus's anti-venom is not yet available, which makes it more deadly and scary. In the case of humans, the venom can result in nausea, respiratory arrest, heart failure, severe and sometimes total paralysis, blindness, and can lead to death within minutes if not treated. Known as the only octopus that is poisonous to humans, most common blue ringed octopus carries enough poison to kill 26 adults, all within a few minutes. 
At birth, the mother injects her own venom into her eggs to make them generate their own before hatching. It's actually the mother's love for her children that protects it. How thoughtful. The toxin is either inoculated using a beak that produces a painless bite or is released directly into the water. The words merciless, ruthless, and unsparing are the right descriptions of its behavior towards its victim. The envenomation results in victims being fully aware of their surroundings but unable to move. Because of the paralysis, they have no way of signaling for help or even groaning in distress for that matter. The victim remains conscious and alert. This effect is temporary and will fade over a period of hours as the venom is metabolized and excreted by the body. The symptoms differ in severity, with children being the most at risk because of their small body size. The whole game is to survive the first 24 hours. Education is the best form of treatment with particular attention needing to be placed with parents as curious children are at great risk of disturbing these otherwise non-aggressive animals. In September 2006, a four-year-old boy was admitted with an acute and progressive skeletal muscle weakness to the emergency department at Redcliffe Hospital in Queensland, Australia. Twenty minutes prior to his admission, he had been playing in the rock pools at a popular beach with his twin brother. His mother had seen him holding a grey-yellow octopus the size of a golf ball, and her description of the animal indicated a blue-ringed octopus. Unfortunately, the specimen was not available for assessment by experts as it was placed back into the water prior to the development of symptoms. The boy reported that the octopus had bitten him. Within 10 minutes from initial subjection, he had vomited three times had lost the ability to stand, and complained of blurred vision. An ambulance was called, and he was transferred to the ED with marked work of natural breathing. The medical term recognized the case as hapalokalena, envenomation with two small bite wounds on the dorsal side of his left hand. Although his cardiovascular reports remained stable, urgent ventilatory support was required. He was released from the intensive care unit 28 hours after the initial bite, with no long-term complications. Other than that, the blue-ringed octopus's popularity can be judged by the facts that in the James Bond film Octopussy, the blue-ringed octopus is the well-known symbol of the secret order of female bandits and smugglers, emerging in an aquarium tank, on silk robes, and as a tattoo on women in the order. The animal was also featured in the book State of Fear by Michael Crichton, where an assassin organization utilized the animal's venom as a favored murder weapon. The Adventure Zone featured a blue-ringed octopus in its Petals to the Metals novel series. A video, originally posted on TikTok, demonstrating a tourist in Australia handling a blue-ringed octopus went viral in January 2019. Wow. It's that okay. Here, my hands are dry. Nice. Wait. Let's I'm... eat it. No, don't say that. I'm just trying to give him some water. Oh. Does it feel weird? It feels really cool. I'm not getting it. Sorry, buddy. Currently, the blue ringed octopus population informatics is listed unknown according to the IUCN. Although, warnings such as bioprospecting, habitat fragmentation and degradation, overfishing and human disturbance, as well as species collections for aquarium trade, may be threats to population numbers. It is possible that Hapalokalena contribute to a variety of advantages to marine conservation. This genera of octopus provides stability of habitat biodiversity as well as expands the balance of marine food webs. Various species of blue-ringed octopus may help control populations of Asian date mussels. Additionally, future research of tetrodotoxins produced by the blue-ringed octopus may produce new medicinal discoveries. Tell us what you think of this psychedelic, mesmerizing, colorful, golf-sized, silent killer beast in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. See you on the next one.